Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel, The Four R's. Today is a great, great day to be alive in the land of the living. Yes, family, it is a great day to be alive in the land of the living. And right here I'm showing you my curtains that I had up and I am gonna take them down and I'm gonna start to decorate my Christmas tree out here. I'm gonna put it up here behind the window. Normally I have it on the opposite side of me, but now I have a china cabinet there. I had my dining room table there. I moved it out from there. I moved the seating area. So we're gonna decorate. It's not going to be all in one day. So come along with me, let us get started. So family, the curtains are all changed out. So right here, I still have not removed that garland at the top there, but I will. So right here on this window right here, this window, it's like a five feet window. And right in front there, we're gonna bring our Christmas tree right there in the middle. So let me go ahead and put it there. Okay, here is my six and a half foot tree. It is a flock tree. I used it last year. I bought this one last year. So now I have all of the branches flopped out, like right in here. I need to pull this out a little bit more. You know, but basically, this is the tree, and what we are gonna do right now is get the lights on the tree. Okay, so I was thinking of putting curtains in here, decorated with curtains, but I don't know exactly family. So. Let's come along with me. Let's see what I'm going to do. I never know what I'm going to do, okay? Okay, so this is my tree all lit up and we are going to decorate it right now. I think I need to put a little bit more lights right over there. So yes, let's do that. I'm gonna do that and I'm gonna start with my topping. The colors that I wanted to use can't locate them but anyhow let's see what we are going to come up with with this tree right here okay fam so this is the top of my tree and now i am going to continue to dress the bottom of the tree putting the other decors and i'm using red but very little red as you can see how that one branch with just those red up there um so i'm going to put some more red but not too much so you will see let's get started okay family here is my tree i had said that i didn't want to use so much red it is not so much red but it is more than I anticipated. So here is all the red that I put in this tree. It's not too much comparing to my previous trees, always filled with a lot of red. So I try to tone it down a little out here on this particular tree. So this is the tree here, all decorated. Okay, I have to move my wires and stuff like that, so ignore that right there. Okay. So I think I might change the skirt. I really don't care for the skirt out here, but I will see how everything comes together when I am finished decorating this room here. And this is my parlor room the first room that you walk up into okay so this is it right here so I'm gonna put it on rotation and you can see how everything is looking so here is the tree rotating around 
So this is my second tree that I have put up. And I don't think it's too much. What do you think? I think it is just enough. And I use a lot of green, different shades of green, basically, and a little gold, not too much gold. As you can see, a little copper, and not too much copper either. A little bronze. So yes, family, that's my tree out here. So I'm going to decorate the mantle out here on top of the cabinet, all of the little spaces. Try not to do too much. I am really, really stretching myself this year. So family, I hope you enjoy this video. If you enjoy the video, please leave me a comment. Tell me what you like, what you think I could have done. Okay? I want to hear your comment if you made it this far into the video. So, I will see you in my next video. Or oh, I am at yours. Be blessed. So this is what the tree looks like with the lights off. Isn't that 